Quentin Quail. Quail reads. Quail reads. Quail reads. Quail words read. Quail words read. Quail words read. Quentin Quail and all his quail friends had been frightened. Everyone quivered and quacked. Quilly Willy, the porcupine, had come waddling right near the quail's nest. Quilly Willy just wanted to send a gift of quills to the quail queen of Quebec. Quentin Quail and his friends were happy to take the quack sound gift. Suddenly, Quentin Quail Quastus and Quitty heard a very queer, strange quacking noise. Quack, quack! Quickly, all the quails stood still, quite still. Quentin Quail knew that if he moved a feather or peeped a word, some enemy might be able to find right where the quails were hiding. Finally, Quentin Quail took a deep breath. Quentin Quail, always quick with a question, asked bravely from his hiding place, Who are you, Quack Quacker? My name is Quacky. I'm just a friendly little duck. You may quit quivering and quacking, Questus and Quitty, said Quentin Quail with relief. Ducks don't bother quails, you know. Quentin Quail, Questus, and Quitty came closer to Quacky. Quentin Quail began to question. Why did you come to see us quails, Quacky? Oh, said Quacky. I learned that the quail queen of Quebec loves honey on her whole wheat toast each morning. I want to give some delicious honey to the quail queen of Quebec. Would one of you quails please take it along on the field trip tomorrow? Please? Hmm, said Quentin Quail, always quick with a question. How much honey are you giving to the quail queen of Quebec? A quart, answered Quacky as he showed the quails his quart jar of honey. I got this quart of honey from a generous queen bee in the woods. It is a good quality honey, the very best, Quacky told Quentin Quail and his friends. How can a quail carry a cart of quality honey? Quentin Quail questions once more. Very carefully, answered Quacky with a friendly grin. Quentin Quail, I would like to carry the cart of quality queen bee honey carefully to the quail queen of Quebec said Quitty Quail, jumping up and down excitedly. You have a quest sound gift, Quentin Quail, a quilt. Questus Quail had a quest sound gift, the porcupine quills. Now, I will have a quest sound gift too, the quart of quality queen bee honey. Quite wonderful, agreed Quentin Quail. Now, let's sing the field trip song for Quacky. One quiet, two quiet, three quiet quails. Walk quite quickly, don't drag your tails. On our field trip, we'll see the queen. Three quiet, quick little quails. Quacky smiled and clapped his wings for the quail singing. <laughs> then Quacky took off from the quail airport. 
Soon, Mommy Quail called everyone to come to Quentin Quail's backyard for a barbecue. We will serve barbecued cricket drumsticks to celebrate the field trip to see the Quail Queen of Quebec, announced Mommy Quail as she greeted all the quail guests. Daddy Quail put a large quail pail of water near the barbecue grill. Daddy Quail wanted to have water handy to quench, put out the fire quickly and safely after the barbecue. When all the quails had finished eating, everyone sat in a quail circle enjoying the evening together. All the little quails were safe in the middle of the circle. Sing your song for us once more time, little quails, requested Daddy Quail. Okay, said Quentin Quail. We have even made up a new verse tonight while we enjoyed the barbecue. Would you like to hear the second verse to our field trip song? Asked Quentin Quail, always quick with a question. Yes, 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 agreed all the quails in the quail circle. One quiet, two quiet, three quiet quails. Walk quite quickly, don't drag your tails. On our field trip, we'll see the queen. Three quiet, quick little quails. One quiet, two quiet, three quiet quails. Walk quite quickly, don't drag your tails. We'll give qu- gifts to the queen. Quilt quart quills from the quails. Just as Quentin Quail and his friends sang the last word, Something quick right past Quentin Quail's ear. Quing, quing. The quail scurried and scattered quickly. Everything became quite quiet. Oh dear, there was a...